Stop it. Get some help. Silly mental what? Nope. And luck with the whistle. Ooh. Wow. Why are you running? Why are you running? Here comes. Cold strike three and Schwarber is thrown out of the game and he had zero issue with getting thrown out. Making it very clear. You've missed him inside, outside, up and down. Kyle Schwarber down there. Yeah, that's uh, there it is. I mean, first of all, as he's trying to get up, and then at the end of this is when he makes the kick. Oh. There's just no place for that in football. Detroit, this, this Detroit team came into this game wanting to show well, unnecessary roughness. Defense number 90 for kicking. Number 90 is disqualified. So not only is this a penalty for unsportsmanlike conduct. And there's the conversation between Jim from the field for Kevin Love tonight from anywhere on the floor. Andrew Wiggins wow. just took a shot to one. Andrew shaking up, still down. Andrew. Taken all the way as he steps out of the box and takes a strike. He flipped the bat. But a strike call will make it three and one. Ortiz ends up striking out. Second out of the seventh inning. He'll say some stuff on the way by and he'll show Timmons where that pitch was. Yeah. Wow. I don't think that phone's going to work anymore. I think he didn't get somebody by mistake with those cuts. Yeah, that's that's dangerous. On after that hundred yard performance in the win last Sunday, Foles gone end zone right back to Kelsey, who thought that he was interfered with in the back of the end zone. No flag. Well, Mukamara ball was too high for Kelsey. Oh, Kelsey is hot. Now he's ejected from the game. He's out. There must have been some verbal confrontation. He was hot. In terms of whatever he said to the official. Well defended. Here's Beverly. This time Durant and a foul call on Durant who barks at him. Durant, they're both out. They've both been just thrown out of the game. Double check to go check for both. Quick ejection. Ed Malloy wasted no time. They've obviously been worn with that first double tech to go. Mantha trying to work it free. Puck comes to Zetterberg, but a Detroit penalty. Virgin comes in and gives him a shot. Nyquist doesn't like it. Watch Nyquist. Retaliatory play on Jared Spurgeon. You have to be in control of your stick. To me, that's one of those where you throw the guy right out of the game for uh Seeger gets hit by a pitch and Weaver gets tossed. Brian Onora has just ejected Jared Weaver. Onora's got time. Seeger's got time. Yeah, I mean. He Matt LaFleur. So the trainer basically is just trying to get in to give assistance to Swift and just he didn't do anything except trying to wedge his way in there which you have to do. And then Devontae Wyatt came in and did the same thing and wow. he saw the floor tell him you got to be smart and he told him twice. With Number seven's unsportsmanlike conduct is disqualified. And the Green Bay fans. You understand why they're upset now. 
It is great to have Mike here in town as we start this third quarter. And whoa, hey no. Morris and Anderson had been jawing before the quarter started, and now they are going at it. So he's looking at the elbow. And now watch him. <laughs> I don't know if I should have laughed at that. what Justin Anderson said. Get a whistle here, and it will be a hooking penalty, and I believe it is going against the Canadians. We'll take a look where this penalty comes, and you, you get your stick up. Shaw's not happy as he destroys that stick in the box. You see the frustration. You're battling. You're trying to extend plays. If you don't, this time shot. And Shaw's going to get the gate here as well, and he still has extra words for referee Brad Watson as he goes across the ice. And there goes the stick rack. Here's the 0-2. Molina hits it sharply. Crawford keeps it on the infield. Long throw to first, and he got him. Wow! Crawford he threw him still out. is able to get Molina, and now Molina has been ejected from this game after throwing his helmet. They've got to calm him down. Molina out, and so is Matheny. He's going to get thrown out here in a second. He's gone, and this crowd is booing. 40,000 plus. They can't believe. Somebody better get a hold of a Molina more than Benji. Made the play. Three two pitch. Whoa. Strike three called and Punto slams his helmet down. You got to be kidding me. And that's how the ball game ends on a very questionable Strike three call and Bob Melvin is chewing on James Hoy big time and he should When Punto did that with a helmet that he was going to be ejected in or at least a fine for Equipment wow. Off the training tapes. What do they okay. want? What don't they want? He's taken six, seven, eight steps towards the bench area. You see the bump there? I mean, the Rec Dean. Here, watch this again. No, he's already reaching. Foul had already took, taken place. Okay. Going to be a whole lot of questions after this one. Let's see what happened with Jamie Collins. So Collins came over. Oh, he made contact with the official on. Okay. He was trying to mimic a little foul and an ejection as well. Silly mental error. No problem to complain and no problem to even. The ball out of him beats hands before he hit his arm. That's a very good point. And oh, Marcus Smart and Embiid. Embiid's going right back at him. Now the officials, when they look at this play, with this type of altercation, they can look at things led up to it and make calls accordingly. Driving on Gobert, puts it up and got it to fall. Gobert falls over top of Kendrick Williams, and there's a trip, and oh, we have no altercation here under the basket. Rudy falls over the top of Kendrick Williams, but Rudy does oh. trip him on purpose. Rudy was in a bad way right there. Between these teams this season. We'll come back to Noah now. Look at this. Boudreaux comes over. And Ross taking the house down. Yeah. As the stanchion and the pane of glass between the benches doesn't look very sturdy. Point got it back to the line. Trick it, trick it. The blade came off of Rask's skate, and he is beside himself. Well, he's got every right to be mad because he was signaling the referee immediately. I mean, I would have liked to have seen him shovel over and take the middle of the net, but I think he's trying to get the whistle. And in doing such, the referee doesn't see it, and they blow this right by him. You know, and, he, and losing his temper, he rips the blade of the Throwing Stroman out and, and Russell out. That's ridiculous. That is terrible. 
And Strowman's got to be calmed down. I don't think I've ever seen a battery thrown out on the same play, the pitcher and the catcher. Three ejections in the inning. Towards second base, it's still sitting on the grass. And now McClendon walks back. He's going to pick up first base a la Lou Pinella. And he's walking away with the first base bag. Does he? Yeah, that. Oh, oh that's. He's going to get tossed, I bet. There's a chance he gets tossed. Bailey did a good job of shutting down that run, and you can't do that. Defense on 99. After this is a goal, automatic first down. Number 99 has been disqualified. Aaron Donald ejected, and there's your night for the Rams. If we're going to be one of the great. See, I mean, foolish, foolish. What is he doing? Are we taken by the neck? I mean, this is one of the leaders that no one works harder. No one studies harder. Nobody is more disciplined about his average better than 30 points. Per first quarter. Oh, there is not a from downtown. Oh, look out. Bledsoe. And I'm not sure who took that first swing. But Bledsoe from Milwaukee was involved. I have to get another look at that. And attacks the closeout. Misses the runner. DiVincenzo, what a play. Pool. In and out. Opportunity for Memphis. And a whistle going the other way. What happened? Steph Curry. Station by the Rangers in the second period. Keep this under control. Left side of your screen. There's Zucker with the first push. The Toronto pushes back, and then Zucker with the trip. Tampa trying to cycle the puck. There's a fourth line. Comfer and Perry are wrestling around in the net, and there's a as the wrestling match ensues, the whistle blows. So both, at least Perry will end up in the penalty box, and at the. down and Morgan's gonna try to score might be a play save Ooh. he just got in I thought he got him and Lou's got to come out to keep his pitcher in the ball game well he bumped him uh, you no. can't do that Carlos come on Carlos you got to be careful <laughs> two strikeouts in the inning for Escalona both looking and Cody Ross has been ejected Chad Fairchild, the home plate umpire, and now Cody is having to be restrained here by Kurt Gibson. Travis LeBoy with a nice hit on Justin, on uh, Colbert, no gain in the play. Oh, now that's Justin bad. Smith's going to get flagged. Now let me tell you, that's this guy right here, that umpire, that's Garth D. Felice. He's one of the toughest umpires in the National Football League. And he, see him push him right there? You can't push him. Can't push him. You cannot show any aggression towards an official. 94 of the defense. That foul was against an official, and it requires an automatic disqualification of number 94. Oh, oh that's huge. He is their best defensive lineman. He is, that's a huge loss for San Francisco. We got a situation. Robbie Anderson has just been apparently kicked out of the game by his own coach. Steve Wilkes, the interim head coach. Anderson said something again to one of the coaches on the sideline. Steve Wilkes came over and, and they barked at each other again. That was one more. Apparently, that was a last straw type thing. Watch Steve Wilkes. He hears something else and he's like, apparently, that's it. I'm taking care of it. And Tripped up. Turnover and Schroeder commits the foul. 
As the Raptors try to make a run, Schroeder gets up and Trent Jr. And OG is saying that he was just trying to help him up. And tempers flaring here in the first quarter with 2.24 to go. You see Fred Van Vliet over there. And Fred is trying to bring Gary Trent Jr. to the... So both players that were involved in the prior incident are gone from the game. Markeith Morris and DeMarcus Cousins done for the night. The end of a end of a shift and Lundquist wanted a whistle and didn't get it so he does this and that's a penalty that's a delay a game penalty. Stone coming in and uh, that's a penalty for sure and it's a bad one but chokes up on the stick to swing a little bit but that's not as hard as a game misconduct needs to be in the playoffs here. And here's where Bennington takes his swat right there at Carlson. And I'm not sure he's just upset getting pulled. Now he's talking to Dubin as he's going off. And I'm not sure I'd want to tussle with Devin Dubnik with the size of him. And that's probably why Bennington heads for the shower. 